<laughs> Stop the intro. Greg, could we change the series to things that Ethan hates about the internet instead? Much, much better. Thank you. Honestly, I've come to terms with what this series is. Me complaining about things that I don't like on the internet. <laughs> the thing we are explaining today is, um... See, see, I, I have the script right here, so I should know exactly what today's episode is going to be about as, as, as I'm reading here in the script. Oh, shoot. I need a guest. I completely forgot. I, I, how could I have missed that? As I'm, as I'm also re reading here in, in, I need a famous internet personality for today's topic, but who's a person that makes clean content is pretty funny, would be great to collaborate with, and who would actually respond to my Twitter DMs. I know. What do you mean you're not going to be in my video? Well, you can't just put my name in the title and then expect me to show up in your video. What about Schmook Network? He made an entire Smash meme compilation and added you in it. Yeah, I'm suing him right now, actually. You must have some great lawyers. Well, uh, not to brag, but I did take a communications law class last semester, so... More like professional YouTuber! Which is why I want you in this video that I'm working on. Well, uh, here's the thing. I, I only collaborate with people who have golden subscribe buttons. But you don't even have a golden subscribe Can you button. please not mention that? <sighs> Fine, but could you at least wait so that way you understand what I'm trying to explain? Uh, you know, uh, honestly, I kind of have a lot to do today. You know, I have a, a selfie to take and uh, I, uh, I probably need to make my bi-yearly tweet and you know just youtuber kind of stuff then how come i've never seen you post a selfie ever oh well yeah i mean i've been taking one every day since i was well four. i have um youtuber stuff to do as well all right well call me back once you have that gold subscribe button keep it up Well, due to unfortunate events, we don't have a guest. He had uh, pr prior obligations. So we're gonna have to fly this one solo. The topic at hand, as much as it pains me to say it, is hair growth time-lapse videos. Honestly, there's not that much substance with this topic. Why don't I like it? Well, Greg, let me spell it out for you. If you've seen one of them, there's really no good reason to watch any other one since it's the exact same concept except with a different person making the second or third or fourth video uninteresting. They get millions of views, which I don't understand and I have no clue how in the world I'm going to figure that out. Also, they keep getting recommended to me and that's just annoying. Plus, there's a loophole with these videos. You can just skip to the end to see the final result. The middle portion is only there to prove that these pictures were taken daily. I wouldn't probably be so negative if this was a one and done situation where one specific person blew up because of this. Yes, that person did blow up, but others did the exact same thing and those specific videos I'm not gonna watch. It's not intriguing to me personally. If you personally like these videos, then good for you. They aren't bad videos, I just don't understand why they get millions of views. Well, I mean, I guess because it went viral. You could watch it in any language because all it was is pictures of a guy's face with music in the background, which makes it a lot more accessible to go viral in different linguistic communities. Most of the time, they're short. I'm almost positive it went viral on Facebook a while ago, and it's extremely shared. Oh, I don't know, Greg. Am I just negative towards them because in my eyes I see it as low effort content that's getting a million views when there are other people out there pouring their hearts and souls into their creative projects on YouTube and are extremely dedicated and they don't even get one sixteenth of those views? Yeah, that makes sense. 